my name is Cherie and I've been working for the City of Burundara at the Bowen Library for six years. I run all the children's programs here, the story times and Sing Baby Sing, Tiny Tots. I get to ins inspire and encourage children to, with their love of reading. I love my job. I'm passionate about this project because daily I get to see the impact of stories and literature on two-year-olds, three-year-olds, four-year-olds and that same twinkle in their eye that I get from them I have seen by talking to the senior citizens that it, it never goes. This universal love and connection of reading is what's inspired my project. The project is all about discovering and learning favourite childhood stories from our senior citizens in Burundara. It's really started through conversations with the seniors when they come into the library, um, just by talking about their favourite books. And so I thought, wouldn't this be lovely to share with the community? When considering how to get the information that I wanted from the seniors, I, I thought that the best way to capture their stories was through conversation and um, written questionnaires. What were some of your favourite stories when you were young? Did you have a favourite character in a novel? I think that the topic that we're talking about is more heart felt, it, it just requires one-on-one -on -one conversation. I've been supported and been able to, given the space to, to have my ideas heard and um, hopefully from, from this one project my colleagues will be able to say, hey, that's, that's fantastic, maybe I can do this or I can do that and I think that I'm lucky that I'm being able to fulfil this wish. Trust your instincts, trust your ideas and creativity. Um, you might think that your idea has been, been done before, however how you do it is your own unique way and um, dance to your own beat. It's just sort of confirmed to me really what a um, universal love, reading and sort of memories of books are to everybody and I think it's just just made me more excited about what I'm doing because um, I suppose when I'm talking to an 80 year old or an 85 year old I realise that regardless of how much they say oh I, I might not remember this and you know I, I'm having trouble remembering that these sorts of memories are more a heart memory I suppose rather than a brain memory and they, they're, they're, they're the real things I suppose, they're things from our childhood and they're relative to everybody and, and that's what it's all about.